Hey guys, welcome back to the DJ channel. Today, I'm going to be putting a stripe on brand new Dodge Durango. Uh, the car is Nordo Gray or something, and uh, I'm putting a set in black stripes on it. And yeah, this is going to be a really interesting project. Um, yeah, let's get started. All right, so I set it up the laser, and what it does is Finding out the center line, it's going all the way front to the roof. And once I finish measuring that, I'm gonna move on to the back and I'm gonna start measuring the, the stripe uh, center on the back area and start laying a knife list and I'm start cutting. Okay, and then I'm gonna start installing the actual stripe. So now, this is a basic tricks, but I don't know if you know about it, but yeah, so when I find out the center, I put the dot on the where the green line is, as you can see this, and that. So this, I'm using a water solvent, uh, the marker. So when I finish finding out, when I finish putting a masking tape on it, or a knife -less tape, I can just wipe it off and then it goes away. It's not permanent marker. So I'm gonna start putting a masking tape on top of the black dot. So the masking tape is dead center. I basically figure out the center line and now I'm gonna move on to the back, uh, actually roof and find out the center as well. I measured the center on the roof and that was fairly easy just because I'll show you this. It's got a it's got a bunch of ridges on the center on the roof, so and also antenna. So I can find out where the center is pretty easily. So I didn't really use the uh, laser but this is perfectly center, and then now I'm gonna do the rear part, and this one is fairly simple as well because it's got a door handle on it, it's got a logo on it, it's got a sensor on it, so it's easy to find out the center. Yeah, once I find the center, then the main first step is done, and I'll move on to the second part. All right, so I decided to go the two inch gap on the center, like that and then uh, <clears throat> the SRT vent the stripe avoiding it so I put the knife less tape along it I kind of free handed it and uh, but I measured everything so it should be pretty accurate and um, yeah I'm gonna start laying the hood and well let's see how it goes before I start the washer nozzle is in the way so I'm gonna have to take it off and uh, start wiping it off and then install it I already cut the vinyl previously, so this is like that. Uh, that's 10 inch and a half, so the 10 inch is gonna be actual block, block stripe, and then uh, a 0.5 is gonna be the uh, the red stripe on the side. Okay, one side is laid, it looks pretty nice, and I'm gonna work on the other side. So 
So now I'm installing a tailgate and the rear bumper and top of the tailgate and move on to a roof. All right, this is a very important part. When I'm trimming it, I'm only clicking this much. So I'm very, really ch shallow, so I'm not gonna cut the car. So it's like, I don't have to worry about it in the future. There's another trick. When you trim that, that kind of tailgate, if you trim along the glass windshield, you're gonna get short edges on the uh, inside of this tailgate because this like quarter inches or three eighths is not enough to go all the way. So what you wanna do is either you put the knife less tape on the glass like quarter inches away from the edge of the glass or you just kind of tuck it in a little bit and then you re-bridge re -bridge the vinyl and then cut along the glass so you're gonna have a little more vinyl to go all the way into the glass so you're not gonna see the color of the paint or all the paint this way you don't see any gray right here so that's you know that's how you know it's clean stripes. That's how, that's you know how it's how it should be done. That's you know that's how you know how the vinyl wrap should be done. All right, so the all the black stripe is done. Now I'm gonna do the red pin stripe on the, the end of the black. So that gives it a little more aggressive accent to it. And once I finish this, this project is done.
Okay, let's see how do you like it. Oh, I missed this one. <laughs> but yeah, so this is a basically finished project. Finished product. And uh, 10 inch red black stripe and then the half an inch uh, the red pin stripe on the side. And that, that center. I think it looks really aggressive and looks really good. Yeah, so basically that's it for today. Uh, I'm gonna do the rest of it and yeah, if you like that video, hit the like and subscribe and leave the comment below. Let me know what you wanna what do you wanna see next next video and have a happy holiday and see you later. Bye.